Good morning. Michael Lipinski again. Uh, we're uh, still plugging away using extending modeling techniques for basic walls. Uh, but before we continue along in this uh, articulation lesson, we really should break down what it is we're trying to convey. Uh, and I think with a logical uh, path should start uh, in this particular chapter with what exactly are we trying to convey and, and what is articulation? Articulated tract or trailer, uh, the formation of clear and distinct sounds, uh, fundamental music parameter, and, and how a single note or other discrete event is sounded, clarity in the production of successive notes, the state of being jointed, or the action of putting into words an idea or feeling of a specified type. Now that's very ambiguous. There's lots of different meanings for uh, certain words. But within the context of this course, within the context of this course, I, I, I want to try to convey to you uh, the meaning behind articulation and what it is you and I, or a collective organization of bodies are trying to convey. So within the context of expressing an idea, we have to communicate. I start this uh, video off with this only because I, I believe uh, word association and how words relate to one another uh, will be the deciding factor as to whether or not you're able to comprehend exactly what entails the creation of notes, what, what it takes to, to convey notes. And I, I'm trying to keep it simple. I, I don't want anyone to lose sight of the underlying theme of architectural endeavors or engineering endeavors. Words can't express certain feelings, certain moods, certain themes. They're, they're just aren't enough words. And in addition to that, pictures are worth a thousand words. What are you trying to express? What are you trying to say? Now, the spoken word can convey information that one is trying to convey. Yet, words can be empty. They could sound like something is going to happen, come to fruition, or they could be empty, just blowing steam. But within the context of this course, if you subscribe to my line of reasoning, you'll find that context matters. We're trying to convey an idea. We're trying to convey an idea and visualize what that idea is to become. You see lots of words written on the walls all over. You drive, you walk, wherever you go on this earth of ours, you'll see words everywhere. Splattered all the landscape. What are we trying to say as a collective body? You, you, you can see in every font, every image, we're all trying to convey uh, something. Everyone wants to, to be heard in some events, in some cases. And some, some like to convey in, 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 their, in, their, own, in their own way. Conveyance is important. Property is conveyed. Ideas are conveyed. 
going from one place to another is a conveyance. It's the science of motion. It's the science of motion. Making something happen. Making something come to fruition. Again, I hope you don't feel that I'm all over with this. Because there's a method to my madness. There's a method to my madness. This is also about time. How much time do we have? So you always have to keep that as an important constant. Because time waits for no one. And we have a lot to discuss. So I'm going to pause this and uh, let you get your coffee. Because we're going to go through articulation. And you'll find it's going to be a rewarding exercise. So get your thinking cap on. Try to get in the right frame of mind. And let's, uh, let's continue diving right into this. It'll return dividends to you. Gain is important in sound. Gain is important in audio. But sustain is just as important. Let's not lose sight of what exactly it is we're conveying and how to get those notes just right. Perfect pitch, perfect tone, perfect treble, perfect timber. It's the perfect theme, style. How you convey is just as important as to what you're conveying. So, no false facades, okay? No false facades. I expect that you understand and know how to utilize this tool. No false facades. You, you can't profess to know and then try to bring in a team of your own draftsmen. You have to know. Don't, don't, don't try the, uh, that route with me. It's not going to work. It's not going to work. This is what you've been hired to do.